the audio book of Think Ahead, Chapter 2. Chapter 2 is entitled, Sorry for Maturing in a Ring. All right. It began somewhere long ago. We always, we always had to say sorry when we thought ahead. Pretty much the pivotal point is you go in, you stack from top to bottom, you make your loopholes, and then you have your goals. And somewhere in there you had defeat too, but you always came up from defeat is the key. You work your way up and down the wires in your life. And so you, it was a monumental statement that made the difference between life and death. Whether you were sorry or just piss poor lorries, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Due season, it's just the time to say sorry. And they had too many ways of thinking that way. Like, I had to apologize for a lot of life. I don't mean to make this such a long chapter, but sorry, it took me places that I didn't think I'd go. You know what I'm saying? Be kind. Treat people how you want to be treated is the key to making a lot of money. And thinking ahead, I was like, how many times do you think you actually have to say sorry in life? How many times would you have to wander off into God knows where with God knows who doing you know what when we were where and what was when and where? But at the same time, sorry is sorry. If you ain't doing nothing with your life, you can look at yourself as a sorry young man. And don't nobody feel sorry for people that feel sorry for themselves. Or maybe they do. Just say it's a brighter broadcast is every side of life. It's kind of like a feature of a of a ring. And Resi 3000, he out. You got to think ahead, people. Think ahead. Uh, chapter 4, the audio book of Thinking Ahead. This chapter I would call, Can You Learn to Dig It? Dig the same, dig the felony. Because somewhere in there, we all got a felony. From top to bottom, once again, it's got to kind of like let it loop over into the loopholes. So I see. Now, somewhere in there, we always made a dash with a heavy foot. But you got to learn. Can you learn to see it from top to bottom? And somewhere it come up like... A lock to an angle insertion. Can you one dash from point A to point B and stand strong? Now, looking at the nouns in the sentence, thinking ahead, now you learn. Now you can learn. Now you learn. Somewhere in there, you make the dash. From now on, you learn. And so, like, why hours form from top to bottom? Why would the top of the hour be the break of the day and the eve of the hour be the break all together? Sometimes, just saying, when you learn, you got to take breaks. And you really break, really. And pumping the brakes ain't nothing wrong with that. But if you're going to learn, learn, take years, times, art class to develop your craftsmanship. Like sh iron sharpened daggers. And somewhere in there, you may, in a split second, you learn not to title with such figurative art pieces. Like the actual discipline of coming out the game. With something you can learn, it's probably pretty rare. And once again, you learn what you learn. You do what you do. To be the man, 
You had to count the times where life was keeping it real. And some days that ain't going to be the best day, but it shouldn't come back the worst day. Somewhere in there, you just got to think ahead. Like somewhere in there, the O's are the most only moments. Only you learn. Some days, because some cats refuse to learn their lesson. So you got to think ahead. When you learn our learning, it, it kind of just turns into like from top to bottom eating your rings. Our rings from top to bottom. Kind of just like, yeah, scream with your hands held high for victory. Victory was the ultimate competition, and many stood long above that. When I say long above, I mean like a dash to the top of the game so fast it happened overnight. <laughs>